Russia to build the world's first DNA data bank of all living things. Not quite the biblical Noah's Ark, but possibly the next thing. Moscow State University has secured Russia's largest ever scientific grant to collect the DNA of every living and extinct creature for the world's first database of its kind. They call it the Project Noah's Ark. It will involve the cre creation of the depository of data banks for the storing of every living thing on Earth, including not only living, but disappearing and extinct organisms. This is the challenge they have set for themselves. MSU Rector Victor Sadvinci told journalists, the gigantic arc set to be completed by 2018 will be 430 square kilometers in size, built at one of the university's central campuses. It will enable them to cryogenically freeze and store various cellular materials which can then reproduce. It will also contain information systems. Not, not everything needs to be in a petri dish, Sadvinci added. The university's press office has confirmed that the resulting database will contain collected biomaterials from all of MSU branches, including the Botanical Garden, the Anthropological Museum, Zoological Museum, and others. All of the university's departments will be involved in research and collation of materials. This program, which has received a record injection of 1 billion rubles, 194 million US dollars, will promote participation by the university's younger generation of scientists. Sadavinci also said that the bank will have a link up to other such facilities at home, perhaps even abroad. If it's realized this will be a leap in Russian history as the first nation to create an actual Noah's Ark of sorts, the rector said, Russia is, of course, not the first to attempt something of this general scale. The quest to preserve biological life forms is one of everyone's should be engaged. Britain has done just that with its frozen art projects, its venture into preserving all endangered life forms, also the first of its kind. They say it's the animal equivalent of the Millennium Seed Bank, a project that encompasses of all the world's seeds.